Hi everyone, Ian here. Welcome to a quick run through of some of the new features in Cavalry 1.2. Let's start with the new string generator. It's called formatted date and time. This will get the date and time where you are and pop it into a string for you. You can customize this format any way you like. Right click to get a list of some helpful tokens. There are a lot more than this, so please see the documentation for a full list. There's a new apply text fill material behavior on the text shape. To use it, simply add it to your scene and then choose your rules and colors. By default, any numbers will change color. This is given by the regex expression in the regex row. Now regex can be a bit scary, so I've added some presets for you. You can get at those by clicking on the presets button in the header here and choosing one that interests you. Instead of using regex, you can also use the specific indices mode. This allows you to specify the indices of characters, words, or lines that you want to get to fill. By default, that's the first and last character, but you can also change this to words if you like. You can also put numbers in here, like one. This will highlight the second word, as zero is the first. Ranges can also be entered as two numbers separated by a colon, like so. This is very much a statement of intent, and we'll be doing a lot more in this space in the future. Sticking with text, there's a new apply character spacing style behavior. This allows you to set custom kerning pairs for your text. Set up a pair once, and all instances of that pair in the text will receive the same adjustment. This is going to be a huge time saver, especially as you can export or copy and paste these between projects. To do this, select the layer, then go File, Export Selected. Then in a new scene, you can go File, Import. And here we have our apply character spacing in a new scene. You can then just hook it up to a text shape like so. We have two very cool additions to the drawing tools. The first is a stabilizer for the pencil. You can turn it on in the tool settings like so. Once on, the pencil line is dragged behind the mouse by a virtual piece of string. This is certainly the most therapeutic way to draw. Another new feature here is the ability to directly finesse Bezier curves by dragging the curves themselves. This is great for making small adjustments.